And that's the power of coaching and therapy and doing your work is managing yourself right in the process is having someone to help you look at other options. Because often we feel like we have no other choices. We have no other options. Um, this person is tying my back. They're blocking me. They're standing in my right. way. They're saying, and there's always other options. There are always other options, but you only know what you know. Yeah. You don't know what you don't know. So when you are managing yourself and you get in community with people who see you, care for you, love you, yeah. people who are going to give you the best advice that they have, you get in community and build a team of therapists, coaches, whatever you need at that moment. Prayer partners. Prayer partners, yes. Mm -hmm. Prayer warriors. club. Whatever. Whatever gives you community. For a a, a parent, maybe it's a parenting group, a father's group, a mother's group, whatever it is. You don't have to do it alone. In fact, when you do it alone, you limit yourself right. on your options. Yeah. Nobody's limiting you. You're limiting yourself because you are tied. Like It's like we said, chess, not checkers. Right. You are only making a move based on what your opponent does. That's checkers. Chess is getting in community, the right spaces, the in, in connection with the right people that can help you see, yes, this door is closed, but that window is open. It's open. I, I, man, it's such a, a, a crazy um, moment to remember this guy. I, his face is coming to me. I'm remembering him so clearly. And I remember hearing him say, Doc, You don't understand. I'm not even doing anything. Mm. And I would say, you are doing something. No, seriously, I'm telling you the truth. He was so sweet. I'm telling I'm I'm telling you all of it. I'm not doing anything. You are doing something. And what I had to explain to him was there's no such thing as doing nothing. Mm -hmm. That's an illusion. Because there's no such thing as passivity. A non-decision is a decision. It's the worst kind of decision because it's a decision by default. Mm -hmm. You didn't even get in the game. Mm -hmm. You're just letting things happen and claiming (laughs) that you have no responsibility as if you're not a powerful being. Right. So. I was saying to him, I said, you you are doing something. And again, it took him a minute to recognize, wow, even the dog that plays dead is doing something. (laughs) He's playing dead. He's playing dead. Mm -hmm. He's doing something. So recognizing all of my energy is either going towards exercising the options that are on the table, identifying options, and deciding where am I going to be in this narrative and story? Mm -hmm. What role do I want to play with my son? How many moments and memories do I want him to have of me showing up at school at the gate, Mm -hmm. right? And saying, hey, son, I can't take you home right now, but I just wanted to see you. Mm -hmm. or doing something that you know is going to make him smile or extending olive branch after olive branch to try to make amends and get clarity or bringing in a third party and saying, listen, I didn't grow up with therapy. I don't even know what this thing can do. But you know what? I was thinking about spending this money on getting a PlayStation for my son. I think I'm going to spend this money on getting someone who can help me get tools or help us get tools for this not to be so combative. Yeah. Because I got to do something meaningful with the something that I'm doing. That's a yummy move right there. Isn't it yummy? That's a yummy move. I got to be strategic because if everything is a decision, then I got to try to make the best ones possible in how I manage me. 